If I'm the problem, why would you park next to the problem? Baby, you my everything. You all I ever wanted. We could do it real big. Bigger than you ever done it. You be up on everything. Other hoes ain't never on it. I want this forever. I swear I could spend whatever on it. Cause she hold me down every time I eat up. When I get right, I promise that we gon' lift it up. She made me beg for it till she give it up. And I say the same thing every single time. I say you the fucking best. Welcome, welcome back to another Vlogmas episode. If you're new to my channel, my name is K or KK, whichever one you prefer. In today's Vlogmas episode, we are basically gonna be catering to ourselves this episode. So I guess you could kind of call it like a self-care solo diaries kind of day. And today, babe, we're just gonna be having like a little one-on-one -on -one solo kind of self-care kind of day, you know? I just basically have like a few things that I wanna get done this vlog, just to kind of cater to myself, y'all, because I'm always catering to everybody else and I'm always doing, you know, the normal day-to-day -day tasks, you know? Know, like cooking cleaning and stuff like that and so today I was like you know what okay we gonna make today all about you girl okay hopefully this video can motivate or inspire somebody else to have them a self-care day or just have you a day it don't even have to be well self-care can be you know all different types of things but okay what are you looking at Anywho, so it don't even necessarily have to be like you going out and spending money. It could be you painting or you just taking the day out watching your favorite TV show, watching your favorite movie, just doing whatever you want to do for you, okay? Right now, I'm just sitting in front of Quick Trip because I wanted to open this vlog up. I'm kind of tell y'all what's on the to-do list for today and basically, where this day going to take us? So today, I have planned to, well, for one, I'm about to go get my eyebrows done, y'all, because my eyebrows look terrible and I did not get my eyebrows done, neither did I get my toes done in my maintenance vlog just because time really really wasn't on my side for that vlog so I got as much as I could get done in like the least amount of time and y'all know hair and nails literally takes the longest out of self care or lashes if you get your lashes done today we're going to be getting my eyebrows done because I didn't get that done in my maintenance vlog and then we're gonna be getting my feet done and I feel like getting your feet done it's maintenance but it's also self-care it's just like i feel like getting your feet done is so relaxing you know getting your toes done is that part of self-care that doesn't feel like maintenance you know what i'm saying like it's just very relaxing you know getting your hands done and getting your hair done it's not as relaxing to me because it's just like you're like okay let's hurry up and get this over with versus your feet it's like you getting your feet massaged you know what i'm saying it's like you got a little masseuse or something, you know this guy decided to park so close to me or maybe did i park close over but as my thing is if i park close to him why would he park beside me hurry up and get in your car man like why would you park beside me we're gonna be getting our eyebrows done today we're gonna be getting our toes done today i want to go get a uh, icy eyeball i think that's how you say it but um i want to go get a bowl because i was thinking about getting chick-fil-a this morning y'all but i wanted chick-fil-a's breakfast not their lunch and y'all know they stopped serving breakfast at 10 30 so yeah we just not even gonna go that route so i'm gonna go get an icy eyeball i was looking at a couple different places but i found this place that had really good reviews and the name of it is i think juice bar or something like that so we're gonna go check them out and we're gonna get us an icy eyeball and maybe like a green juice or something i don't really know but i kind of got a taste for fruit this morning i wanted to go to chick-fil-a and get one of their chicken you know one of their chicken biscuits and then i wanted to get like one of their little yogurt bowls but they're not serving it no more so 
kind of out of luck. I don't really know what else we gonna do today. It may just be like a little chill day. I know I'm also gonna be going to go get some hygiene products, but that's gonna be in another vlog, not this vlog. But yeah, let's go ahead and go and get our eyebrows done real quick because I wanna feel like cute while I'm gonna go do my self care stuff, you know? And I feel like what's the best way of getting cute besides getting your eyebrows done first? Why would we save that to the end? We could do that first. We're gonna be going to this place. It's called MD Beauty. Um, if y'all don't know, I used to have like a little eyebrow lady that used to do my eyebrows, but when was it? It was around my birthday. I needed my eyebrows done, y'all, and I guess she was out of town around my birthday time. Y'all know my birthday is at the end of October. I'm like a Halloween baby, two days before Halloween. So she ended up being out of town around my birthday time. So I went to this eyebrow place called MD Brows or MD Beauty, something like that, and they ended up doing my eyebrows, y'all. When I say that was like literally the best I had had my eyebrows done in like probably probably like a year or two i'm gonna go over there and get my eyebrows done hopefully i can get them done by the same lady because baby she did her biggest one okay yeah let's go ahead and hit that way and then we're gonna go get our bowl next because your girl is kind of hungry but i figured i could get my eyebrows done first because that's not gonna take a lot of time okay safety first as y'all know baby we won't go nowhere without putting that seatbelt on oh it's only six minutes away let's get it yeah i've been having drake faithful on repeat lately okay i guess i'm the one who can't drive because this guy act like he can't get into his car i'm just so sick of all these people parking next to me like if i can't drive don't park next to me straight like that if i'm the problem why would you park next to the problem you know what i'm saying i just i don't get it i don't get it babes but anywho, like I was telling y'all, so Drake Faithful has just been on repeat real bad for me because y'all, I just feel that song on a different level because like, you don't have no time to lay up. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, I guess they mad. <laughs> I guess they mad. <laughs> Oh, y'all hear my stomach growling, but anywho, so yeah, we don't have no time to lay up. We just trying to be somebody before we say we need somebody, okay? Check, so yeah, that's just been on repeat. I hate when the light changed before I can figure out what my maps is saying. You would think it's all mine, the way I took it. You would think it broke down, the way I push it. Working, 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 ain't you? You don't have no time to lay up. Okay, y'all, we back in the car. We got our brows done. Period. Brow check. Okay. She did her big one. And I think that was a different lady that time they did them from the last time. But it's like they do my brows the same every time. So, or at least the first two times I've came, I've been completely obsessed because, babe, brows is looking good. So yeah, y'all, my brows is looking good. Um, I tried to record in there, but I don't know what it is with eyebrow places not liking you to record. I think the only place you can really record when you get your eyebrows done is if like you have a technician that do your eyebrows and they like let you record, like you know them, you know what I'm saying? Or if like you go to the nail shop and get your eyebrows done. But y'all know I don't get my eyebrows waxed. I only get my eyebrows threaded because it just look better and it lasts longer to me in my opinion. And then a lot of the times that wax be making me break out. I don't know if it's that nail shops don't be clean or if it be the wax that break me out but nothing against it i just personally don't prefer it you know y'all my battery about to die so give your girl a second and then i was in there y'all and she was like you off work today i was like um no i'm working i'm, I'm trying to get content i was like i'm a full-time content creator like i'm a full-time youtuber thank you god in advance baby even though i have a job i don't necessarily tell people i have a job i always tell people like when i run into people and they be like do you do this full-time yeah i do do this full-time i do <laughs> thank you god in advance okay period <laughs> because yeah yeah, what do I look like not speaking it into existence? What? Because a year from now, I'm gonna be saying, yeah, I do this full time and I really am gonna be doing it full time. But I feel like even though like I make money outside of YouTube, I feel like I am a full time YouTuber because baby, this is a full time job, okay? Especially the way your girl been being consistent, full time job, full time, okay? So yeah, but um, Oh, you know what? I wanna take like a little picture of my eyebrows, y'all, hold on. Okay, yeah, I feel like we got some good content 
for the eyebrows so we about to get ready to head to this juice bar i'm about to put in the um thing in my maps but y'all i ended up so this place that i'm at it's a fused furniture like right across the street from it and i see that just open because it say grand opening because i know like i tried to go to fused furniture twice and the only two i found was it was the one in frisco and it was one in arlington which is both a ways from me frisco and arlington i was just waiting for them to make one like right smack dab in the middle and i kind of want to go in there but i'm not gonna do it today i just don't feel like it and i'm a big advocate well not even advocate but if i i know for sure i'm not gonna buy anything out of there so it's just like i don't want to defeat the purpose of me going in there and it's like i know i'm not gonna buy nothing and then i see something that i like I feel like you you know what I'm saying but yeah we about to go to this let's see how far it is from here it's only six minutes from here I'm loving that every place I stop at it's like five six minutes from the next place I really want to check that fused furniture out y'all but I just do not want to go in there today I gotta start sleeping at the studio I don't have no time to be no Romeo yeah Drake low-key be throwing shots in his music and I just be laughing because it's like Drake <laughs> like did you have to say that you know what I'm saying why my camera be doing that? Like, it just cuts off in the middle of me filming. If you got a Canon G7 next to you, be having no problems, let me know. Because, baby, I'm finna go team Sony. Like, Canon, I'm not finna play with y'all. Anywho, like I was saying, I'm listening to Do Not Disturb. And he talking about something. I gotta quit sleeping at the studio. I ain't got no time to be no Romeo. <laughs> like, Drake, why would you say that? Like, why would you say that? Why? Oh, I thought it was going red. I mean, going straight on the red light. Let me mind my business. But, like, Drake, why would you say that? You know what I'm saying? Like, y'all know Romeo ain't got no hits for real. Y'all know Romeo ain't nobody for real. Like, <laughs> Drake told me he ain't got no time to be no Romeo. That man is hilarious, man. But anywho, back to the vibe, y'all. I just want to come on here and, you know, I just want to come on here and say that. <laughs> yeah. so cute y'all oh go ahead go ahead go ahead go ahead go ahead go ahead are you parking oh sorry it just looks so cute it's right beside einstein bros which i've never had that before but it just looks so freaking cute i'm gonna sit down in the inside and eat my bowl because i need to actually charge my batteries before i go to um or get as much charge as i can before we go to go get our toes done Okay, I have a question. Would that be possible to like customize a bowl? Yeah, just have like the ingredients that are here. Like, okay, right. Okay, cool. I'm about to try some of that yogurt. They got like a bunch of bowls that, well not a bunch, but they got two bowls that I'm like debating between. So they got a just peachy and then they got a yummy yogurt. So with the just peachy, the base is ICI peaches and Texas honey, which sounds so freaking good, especially the peaches and the honey. So we about to try this real quick. Y'all, why is this camera, this battery about to die too? The yogurt is good. It's just a little too sour for my liking. Okay, yeah, let me try it like this. Okay, y'all, so we got our bowl. So basically it's the icy at the bottom and then you got blueberries, you got strawberries and you got blackberries. And then I'm trying to show y'all what I was spilling it. But you got blueberries, blackberries, strawberries, and then you got granola and you got almonds at the top. So I've never had my I see y'all with almonds, so we about to see how this tastes. And then they sprinkle honey over it also. Next time I come back, so they gave me like a little card y'all that I could like basically scan every time I come. So the next time I come back, I'm for sure going to try the yogurt because I really wanted to try the yogurt. But I was like, you know what, let me try the I see y'all because I've tried it at Smoothie King, but I never really tried it like at any other place. Everything tastes really fresh, y'all. Y'all, why got my batteries charging on the inside? Because my batteries died, so I got them charging on the inside. I don't know if I like the almonds, y'all, because I'm not really an almond girl, but the granola with the fruit and the honey and the icy. Mm-hmm. Y'all already know what I'm about to say, 10 out of 10. Well, y'all, I'm about to finish my bowl, and then I'm about to watch a YouTube video, and I'm going to catch y'all a little later. Probably go get our toast done. Don't let pride stop you from going back home. It's okay to live with mom and dad while you're getting on your feet. You have the rest of your life to pay bills, sis. Take advantage of their offer. 
If a man wants to change, he will. I'm going to say it again. If a man wants to change, he will. So stop trying to fix him. And unless a man tells you and shows you, heavy on the shows, that he wants to be exclusive, then he's not your man. So learn to date. Don't put all your eggs in one basket. It's okay to get to know more than one person at one time and always have options because, child, they do. You want the prize. Stop letting the natural hair community convince you that straightening your hair is conforming to European standards. You are clearly stressed from hours of detangling, so if you like how your hair looks straight, then pick up a blow dryer and a flat iron whenever you feel like it. Do what's convenient and what makes you happy. Things I would tell myself at 23, now that I'm 33. Never take a job offer without negotiating your salary. Always ask for more money. The worst thing can say is no. Y'all, I definitely need some, like, floss because, baby, when I tell y'all that stuff got all in my teeth, all in it. But I'm about to go ahead and put some chapstick on because, baby, my lips is dry. I like to go in with this cocoa with a chapstick. And then I just like to go in with some regular lip gloss, y'all. But I need to give me, like, a lip scrub. I need a lip scrub bad, y'all, because I've been noticing, like, my lips have been peeling so much. And I know it's because it's, like, wintertime and it's getting cold. And usually I don't, like, you know not to toot my own horn but usually my lips are always soft like i don't really have to do the whole like lip scrub thing but i ain't with my lip gloss not trying to come out my lips getting to where like oh i did not mean to throw my lip gloss in there my lips getting to where they like peeling and stuff and i know it's because it's getting colder outside and you know you need like good moisture for your lips especially in the cold baby yeah i just i need to start using like a lip scrub because i can't just keep walking around with my lips looking crusty y'all i'm trying to see where i want to go get my toes done at it was this guy that came to my job and he was like recommending this place i should have toes done at he was like go here and ask for this lady and i literally can't find a note i know i put it in my notes y'all because i can't remember anything like i'm always trying to remember certain stuff dang y'all i am literally trying to find this note I literally have no idea where it's at, but we about to find a nail shop to go to so we can go, so I can go get my toes done. But regardless of what you're going through, you have to believe in better times. I know you at a point that you want to settle down, so you pray that things happen to work. But sometimes you have to put your pride aside and put your happiness first. And all my curses, walking in my purpose, doing it on purpose. I don't know death, I'm pro life. It's amazing. I guess it is, but you make it. Y'all, so, okay, baby, my eyebrows are just eating down, but y'all, I'm inside of this place. It's called Sally. I'm gonna insert, like, the name or something because I don't know how to pronounce it, but it is so freaking cute in here, y'all. Like, the ambiance eats down. And I got this little area over here with, like, the different colors and stuff, but I think I'm gonna just do white. And the people in here seem so sweet and so nice. So, yeah, you girls excited. I'm about to show y'all around in here, though. And they tree is so cute. If today was the worst day, just remember what your kin say that we breathe in, just breathe in, breathe out, and we breathe in, just breathe out. Breathe it don't matter what you do, who you see, who you screw, because we breathe in, just breathe out, and breathe out, breathe in, just to breathe out. I wish every day was a different day. I mean, I wish everybody had acted differently. I'm turned off from listening to bullshit, off in the pulpit on this unit. I came back from Atlanta on the phone screaming, who's this? Nobody brought this to the point that I have, but I'm feeling real good and I'm happy. I ain't overly sad. I can say that. Don't you feel me? I ain't overly sad. I said there's no time for shit, man. I ain't overly sad. Hey, I know you heard it because I said it with purpose and you know that I know you feel so good. I know that it's worth it to be the smoothest I can be. Although you've heard it before, I know you can't. Not ignore the feeling of it from free. I just want to slow things down for a minute. Make it all feel real good when I'm in it. Uh, ain't really anything that's tripping me up. I said it enough. You want a tip, I flip you a buck. It don't even matter if today was the worst day. Just remember what you can say. That we breathe in just to breathe out. Yeah. Breathe in just to breathe out. You my everything, you all I ever wanted We could do it real big, bigger than you ever done it You be up on everything, other hoes ain't never gone it I want this forever, I swear I could spend whatever on it Cause she hold me down every time I hit up When I get right, I promise that we gon' let it up She made me beg for it, till she give it up And I say the same thing every single time I say you the fucking best Yeah. 
shorty, I'll be over there I'll be hitting all the spots that you ain't even know was there <laughs> And y'all don't even have to ask twice You could have a heart or we could share it like the last slice Always felt like you were so accustomed to the fast life Have a nigga thinking that he met you in a past life Sweatpants, hair tied, chilling with no makeup on That's when you're the prettiest, I hope that y'all don't take it wrong Y'all don't even trip with friends, say you ain't bring a drink alone You know that I'm working, I'll be there soon as I make it home is she a patient in my waiting room? Never pay attention to the rumors and what they assume. And until them girls prove it, I'm the one that never get confused. Get confused, get confused. You the fucking best. You the fucking best. You the fucking best. You the fucking best. That's how you're the hand. 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 Sex, love, pain, baby. I be on that tank shit. Buzz so big, I could probably sell a blank. My album drop bitches apply for the picture And niggas apply to and claim they got it for their sister Magazine, keep the girl the money ain't the issue They bring dinner to my room and ask me to an issue She called me the referee cause I be so official My shirt ain't got no stripes but I could make your pussy win So, like the Andy Griffith theme song And who told you to put the jeans on? Double cup love, you the one I lean on Feeling for a fix that you should really get your feet on Yeah, just know my condo is the crack spot Every single show she out there rapping like a mascot Get it from the back and make your fucking bra strap pop All up in your slot till a nigga hit the jackpot Oh yeah See this is the type of joint you gotta dedicate to somebody Just make sure that that's best for somebody your girl has made it back to the house. I'm actually about to eat some roast here real quick because your girl is hungry again. And then y'all, I'm about to get some editing done because I'm trying to get a vlog out today. I'm about to edit while my battery's on the charger. Both of those are dead. This one has two bars. So I'm gonna try to at least have two out of the three charged. So we just about to edit until those get fully charged. This time my, oops, excuse my hair y'all, but this time my toes came out. She did a good job. They came out pretty good, so. Besides sister girl cutting me, she did a pretty good job. I'm thinking I'ma cook today, but I'm not sure. If I don't cook today, then I'm for sure gonna cook tomorrow. But yeah, let me catch y'all a little later. Don't be upset with your girl. I was vlogging two videos this day and I accidentally forgot to close this vlog out. So yeah, here I am closing it out. I love you so much. I appreciate you so much. And I hope y'all enjoyed this vloggy. And y'all already know until the next vlog, the big is she out the cut. Okay. Kisses. Toodles. Why you gotta fight with me at Cheesecake? You know I love to go there. Say I'm acting light skin. I can't take you nowhere.